Glass Engraving Tips In this lesson, we'll go over some useful tips for glass engraving. Let's start with the standard process for engraving glass. First, import your design into the software and set your parameters. Next, place the glass workpiece on the engraving bed. Put a sheet of paper on the engraving surface. Click Focus to perform autofocus, then click Preview to check size and position. When everything looks good, click Start to begin engraving. That's how you complete a standard glass engraving. However, some types of glass have special optical properties. So their true focus distance is usually 2 to 3 millimeters shorter than the autofocus result. To get sharp results on these glass, you'll need to find the true focus distance, and that's where the ramp test comes in. After autofocus is complete, lift one end of the glass slightly, then engrave one long straight line across the sloped surface. You'll notice some parts engrave clearly on the back side of the glass, some appear in the middle, and some show up right on the surface. Take a caliper or ruler and measure the distance from the laser head to the two spots where the engraving looks the sharpest. For example, point A, 180 millimeters, point B, 181 millimeters. But the field lens manual focus distance is supposed to be 183 millimeters. This shows us that the real focal point on this glass is actually 2 to 3 millimeters above the autofocus result. Engraving images inside glass. If you want to engrave an image inside the glass, first, performance focusing. Then lower the laser head manually. The engraving will typically appear inside the glass. Master these techniques and you'll be able to achieve clean, accurate, and beautiful glass engravings every time. If you have any tips or suggestions, feel free to contact support at commarker.com or leave a comment below.